It will hurt along the way. Now here's the beautiful thing about success. There's enough space for everybody, but everybody don't have what it takes. So what happens along the way is that we have these dreams and these goals and these ideas and all these things we want to do and then life puts us to the test. The first thing that life does to test you is it makes you go through a little pain. If you can't handle that pain, you can't handle success. If you can't handle disappointment, you might as well check out now. Just quit, just give up like most people do. See, we all go through pain. We all go through pain, but some of us stay on the ground and cry about it. Some of us stay there, but some of us get up. So when you go through pain, if you can get through it, you're going to be stronger than the person who's never felt pain. And you'll be able to handle stuff in life because you're used to going through the pain. Do you understand it's the difficulties that are going to prepare you and take you to the next level? So what if you failed your last exam? So what if you had to retake the year? Do you understand you got through that? You're all running from obstacles. When in fact, it's the obstacles that's gonna take you to the next level. You're all running from pain. You're all running from challenges. You're all telling me how difficult your life is. You got put through that because what that does, that tension produces greatness. Stop running from it, start running to it. You did it once, you did it twice, and it didn't work, so you quit? Yeah, you did it for three months. Yeah, you did it for six months. And you're like, we're out of results. Look, it's going to take more than six months for it to become a reality. You've got to learn to stop starting and stopping. You've got to learn to stop quitting and giving up just because it didn't work out for you the first time. Just because it didn't work out for you the 20th time. You've just got to keep going and keep going. What you need to know about life is you cannot lose if you do not quit. So you got to keep studying, keep reading, keep doing what you got to do. And if you can weather that storm, I guarantee you every dream you have will become a reality. There are no limits, just the ones you place on yourself. Look, you got to do it with passion. You got to go to college with passion. But you're going to college with an attitude. You're going, but you don't really want to be there. You're not bringing the passion. You're not bringing the fire. You're not bringing the heat. You're studying, but you're barely doing it. Come on. Surely, you got to be tired of this 60% you. Greatness is within you. You are here. You have been blessed to be on this earth. You're here. Do something. So whatever you got to do, you do it. I'm a firm believer that talent alone is not enough to be successful. I'm a firm believer that the amount of work you put into something is more important than anything. The amount of work you put into something, the amount of effort that you give, I'm a firm believer that just because you grew up in a certain neighborhood, just because your parents are rich or your mom's a doctor, they're not giving out degrees. They're not giving out success. So what I'm trying to say is that exams, that's your life. That's your future. Don't look at it like it's a punishment. Don't look at it like, I gotta go to class. Whatever you write down, you're literally at school to make your dreams become a reality. So every single day you wake up, this is what should be on your mind. This is what you should be pursuing. You've got a small window. Listen to me. You've got a small window. And the problem is, when you're young, you think you've got forever. It's a disease of young people. It's a disease when you're young. You're like, I can go to this party. I'll bounce back. I don't have to study this week. I'll bounce back. You think you'll keep bouncing back. No, you won't. Many of you are not taking ownership of your life. That you have not looked at yourself in the mirror and said, you owe you. Will the world know that you are here? Or will you be a distant memory? Will you leave your mark? You've got to stay ready because I know one thing in your life, the opportunity will come. But will you be ready when it gets there? So I'm going to finish by telling you this. It's going to come. 
everything you've ever dreamed of, every opportunity you ever dreamed of, it's gonna come. But will you be ready when it comes? <laughs>